First off, God is good. God is in the center of everything that we have going on, so therefore we are blessed and highly favored. But let's get into this message on today. We are so blessed. We are so we have so much to be thankful for. Everything is a blessing. Waking up is a blessing. Seeing your family off to school is a blessing. Waking up next to someone wonderful who's on the same page with you, and maybe not the same page, but you, at least you have someone to wake up to. The food that we are being that we receive at every feeding three times a day is a blessing. The finance to be able to have a roof over your head, to have stability is a blessing. The transportation to get to work is a blessing. Life is a blessing. Fresh oxygen is a blessing. Going outside and seeing the sun rise is a blessing. Being able to walk to the door, open the door, go outside to get the fresh air is a blessing. Being able to go prepare your meals for all these feedings is a blessing. We are so blessed, but yet we sit there and focus on what we don't have and we feel like we're not blessed. We are blessed. We have it all. We, the Lord provides everything that we need, not what we want, but what we need. And it gives us his power and will. We could follow him and seek him to get that guidance, that peace that we so much desire. It is not in things. It is not in stuff. It is not in working harder. It is not in trying to have multiple streams of income. It is not trying to change our partner every time that is not working out our way. It is so much to be blessed for. And sometimes when I go out here and I'm driving, I go to the grocery store, I go to pick up something I need to pick up for the home. People are zooming, zoom, 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 just racing and hustling, trying to get back to work or get to wherever they're going. Sometimes they're just going home and it's like, speed, speed, slow down a bit. If you slow down, you'll truly see how blessed you are. Like if you take your focus on what you want with this heart here desire sometimes and really sit back and be like, man, I have more than enough. So many people would love to be in this my situation right now, but yet I'm still looking out the window for something else and something else. Like, no, focus on what the Lord has blessed you with and understand that you are truly blessed from the bottom of my heart, I'm telling you, because. I speak on a lot of stuff that I went through, like similar situations, like moving into this home and then looking across the street and like, ooh, I wish mine was in that color or my grass looked like that or my lawn was shaped like that or I had that type of vehicle or all these different things. And that was just stealing my joy, stealing my happiness, stealing my peace. But now I'm just learning to stay focused in what the Lord has blessed me with and understand that the Lord gives me everything I need and not what I want. That is wonderful. So if you are blessed by this message on today, hope you share it and just continue to be kind to people because you never know what people are going through. Have a blessed day. See you next time.